These are the elevators at the Health Careers Building at CPCC Central Campus in Charlotte, North Carolina. These are Tissencrub. This one is a regular size and the other one's a hospital size. These are hydraulic. These were installed in Tesla Nights so that are relatively new. And they have the double buzz. I'm gonna step off here. No, it's busy up here. Here's something pretty crazy though. One on the left is a standard size, one on the right is a hospital size. But have a look at this. Step up here. There's this little area back here. There's like nothing up here. With the exception of a couple of mechanical rooms. I'm not sure if the controller is up on the top story or or where it's at, but I know the hydraulic motors are of course down at the bottom of the building. But it's funny. There's like a sixth level up here. It's not even a full level. It's about half of a level. And this hospital size elevator, of course, has two doors, and this one opens up on the back side. This elevator also has a um, um, rear opening on the first floor. Notice the um, one R on the floor indicators. Well, at least when you get inside the cab, when you notice on the fixtures, which these are vandal resistant. I'll tell you what's a funny, a funny way to confuse people, especially during peak hours, is step back here, wait a few minutes, and press the call button. This elevator will stop for people waiting on floor five that are intending on going down. Half the time they don't even pay attention to whether the indicator is saying up or down, they just step on. And then they wonder why the elevator goes up. So there's people getting on right now, but here in just a moment, we're going to call it and ride this one. The other one has, this is your basic sounding motor. This one has a pretty cool sounding motor. I'm going to call it. And I already mentioned these were vandal resistant fixtures. Which of course I know TJ elevator fan, Diesel Ducey, and all these other people that film elevators will love this. Of course this isn't this isn't really my main hobby, of course. I like to fix computers and I'm into cycling, not really into elevators, but yeah, I figured I'd make a few videos just for y'all. It's starting to come back this way. It'll probably make a few stops. See, floors four and five are usually the most common floors for this thing to stop. It stopped on four. Here it is. Notice this one has a much bigger cab. Go down to one. Let's see if we have any company or not. There's the rear door closing. The motor you're hearing is actually for the one, is the motor you heard was actually for the other elevator cab. There's a look at the vandal resistant fixtures. I'm 
we'll send this one back up to five. So you have to listen to the motor. Might have some company here. Select five. Good, we're by ourselves. Have to listen to this motor. some of the nicest ones and here we are at five all right now it's going to show you the other elevators in this building back in 2009 they built this health careers building more or less added it onto the existing Belk building which was built in the early 70s Okay, here we're at the back side of the belt building. And here's the other elevators. These are quite tiny. And here's a look out the giant window. There's a brand new building they're working on right now. They replaced the old Van Avery building. Here's your good view of Center City Charlotte. the elevator. These elevators, I'm not sure what brand they are. I believe they were modernized by Southern. And I think maybe ThyssenKrupp may have had their hands on these too. As I mentioned, they're real tiny. Let's go ahead and have a look at one. We're only going to be riding these down. These are traction. These are much faster. Not sure which ones we're going to get. Notice the fixtures. Look like a kind of vandal resistant type, not exactly sure what kind they are. There's your indicator. Looks like a looks like a southern. These may be these elevators may be Dover or maybe Otis, the original ones. They were installed in 74. Look at the floor indicator. That's original. So you guys out there that are elevator fanatics, tell our brand these are. Now look at those floor indicators. So anyways, there you have it.